Amidst all the political turmoil in the state of Maharashtra, we have fresh pictures of the former Chief Minister Uddhav Thakre at the Sena Bhavan that you can see on your screen right now. These are visuals of Uddhav Thakre. In fact, uh, just some time ago, he also spoke to the people there, spoke to the press, spoke to the Shiv Senex, the supporters who have in fact stood by him. He thanked the people. He said the tears of the people are his strength. He's also lashed out. He's spoken about betrayal. He says, backstab me, but do not backstab the people of Maharashtra. These are visuals of Uddhav Thakri and his supporters at the Sena Bhavan. This is the former chief minister of Maharashtra who's had to step down, essentially, given that he does not have the numbers that are required to keep his flock with him. Eknath Chinde, the new chief minister, of Maharashtra has in fact taken over the trust board of course is on the 4th of July but this is a situation where there is political turmoil in the state of Maharashtra. The Thakre spoke a few some time ago in fact raising various issues talking about the fact that there has been a betrayal. These are visuals of Thakre right now at the Sena Bhavan in Mumbai. In fact, he's also come out and said that he's not going anywhere. He's going to be sitting in the ship Sena Bhavan. This comes at a time, interestingly, when there's not just a fight for the chief minister's chair, but also for the legacy of Bala Sahib Thakre. With Eknath Shinde saying that he hopes to call his party Shiv Sena Bala Sahib. There is going to be a huge tug of war that actually has already started over the legacy of. Bala Sahib Thakre. Uddhav Thakre, remember, announced his resignation on Wednesday after the court gave a go ahead really to a floor test in the state assembly, knowing very well that he does not have the numbers with him. These are visuals. First on India today of Uddhav Thakre right now in Sena Bhavan with the supporters surrounding him. Important and interesting political developments in the state of Maharashtra with Uddhav Thakre heading out at Ikna Chinde talking about the reversal of important decisions like the RA Forest Metro Car Shed Project which was an issue close to his heart. A decision interestingly that he had reversed when Devendra Padnavis had stepped down as the Chief Minister of Maharashtra more than two and a half years ago. Now the tables have turned with Eknath Chinde reversing the decision of Uddhav Thakri to declare the 800 acre forest area as a reserve forest area. Vidya is getting us the very latest, joining us from Sena Bhavan right now, where Uddhav Thakri Vidya is meeting with the supporters, surrounded by the people who are still standing by him. Uh, well, uh, you know, he did meet some of his supporters. He was here for about an hour and a half or so. Uh, but then he's returned back to his residence, uh, Matoshri. Uh, he had come here. Uh, there was actually no planning of a press conference. However, with regards to the turn of events that have happened where Eknath Shinde has taken the oath of office and uh, also, remember, immediately Devendra Farnavis and he held the first, uh, you know, uh, uh, the cabinet meet and immediately reversed the order that Uddhav Thakur himself had given. So, you know, re replying to both these things, he said one very clearly that Eknath Shinde is not a Shiv Sena CM. He said very categorically, he is not a Shiv Sena CM, he is a CM but not of the Shiv Sena party. Apart from that, the second which is important thing that he said was that, you know, if you have any anger against me or my party, then you need to reply to that rather than, uh, you know, mistreat the city of Mumbai. The only surviving lung of Mumbai, that is the RA, the uh, Sanjay Gandhi National Park, you know, these should not be disturbed. He is still asking and he is requesting the government to not go ahead with making RA car shed, the metro car shed which is to be made at RA and instead go ahead head with the uh, one which is at Kanjur Maan, which he had selected. However, obviously the BJP is not in such mood. BJP has very clearly said 
that the land which is in Kanjur Mar, which was an option to the RA car shed, was actually is, is under yes. litigation. There are uh, people who are claiming land. They are saying that it, uh, you know, it, 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 they are private persons. There is union government. There are such people who are claiming the property. In that case, construction of metro there is not a possibility, and it would certainly escalate the price as well. So All right. both these things are being said by the BJP. We'll really have to wait and see as to what the government decides. Absolutely, Vidya. The BJP is trying very hard to allay the fears given that the perception is that Devendra Fadnavis again is going to uh, be really calling the shots. Um, is somebody who is pro-development and wouldn't blink uh, before uh, you know, even thinking about the fact that this project could hamper the environment. This is a concern that activists also have been thanking you for the moment.